Hi, my Virgos. It's Jamie Zebra 23. I am doing your February mid month uh, 2017 general tarot card reading for Virgo, Sun, Moon, and Rising. I'm using the Rider Waite Tarot deck. Um, I pulled five cards because it is a mid monthly. I am on Facebook. You should like me. It's Jamie Zebra 23. Also, I do personal readings. If you'd like one, you can contact me at Jamie Zebra 23 at gmail.com. Um, I learned how to make links. Woohoo! So um, the links will be in the description box. Um, uh, readings are $25 for 15 minutes, $50 for 30 minutes, $75 for 50 minutes, five zero minutes. Readings are done over the phone or through Skype. It's your choice. Um, also, um, PayPal is the method of payment. Um, I also have a one question, one answer for $5 via email only. Um, one question, one answer, $5. Um, I'm on all kinds of social media. I'm on Twitter. I'm on Skype. I'm on, oh, that's not social media. <laughs> I'm on YouTube, I'm on um, Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter, Facebook, I'm, I'm on pretty much all of it, and they're all Jamie Zebra 23, Jamie Zebra 23. Um, oh, if you were, if um, I have three Facebooks, one is just for friends and family, one is like a fan page, kind of where you can just like it, click like, um, and that's the one I'm inviting you guys to on, um, then I had one more where it was kind of like my public page where I would add friends to it. I had to erase all of my friends because a psychopath, a lady was like threatening to kill me and my mom and my whole family and like threatening to kill other people on my friends list. She was just like, she went nuts. I don't know her. I guess she just saw me on YouTube and went nuts. Yeah, really creepy. Um, yeah, so she started messaging everybody, all the friends that were on my friends list because I'm using my phone. So I can't from my phone make my friends list private. So it's visible. So that's why I just took everybody off because people were like threatening or people were contacting me saying this lady's threatening. She says she's a tarot reader and she's going to make my mom's heart stop. I was like, she's a fake. She's not a tarot reader and she's a psychopath. Yeah, her name is Nicole Lawrence. I've got all the messages to prove everything. I've even posted it on my uh, Facebook page for everyone else to see. Um, I respect other people's privacy. So when they sent me the messages, screenshots of the messages, I didn't, yeah, I didn't post them. But she's, if you guys are dealing with this lady, just ignore her. She's a fake. She's a creep. Just, yeah. So now to the reading. All right, Virgo. All right, so you got the Six of Wands. You've got the King of Cups. You've got the Temperance card. You've got the Five of Wands. And then you've got the Knight of Wands. So here's what's up. The beginning card and the end card shows moving. All right, Virgo, so you may be moving somewhere, changing jobs, uh, relocating, or going on a trip. Because you're doing this, you may decide to permanently stay wherever you're going, or you may decide to go back from where you just where you just were. Okay, with the King of Cups here, this may have something to do with a Cancer, Pisces, or a Scorpio. The Temperance card, it's saying mixing the old and the new together, coming together uh, to make new results. So a lot of you are going to be taking back an X. The X could be a water sign or the X could be an air sign or a fire sign. So this is the players that I'm seeing here are Cancer, uh, Cancer Pisces, Scorpio, Aquarius, Libra, or Gemini, and Sagittarius, Aries, or Leo. So the, those are the players that are here, okay? So either there's an air sign coming towards you from the past or uh, a fire sign coming towards you from the past. Some of you are choosing to make it work with a water sign, hoping that this time things will be different. Also with the with the fire sign be careful with the fire sign this could be a friend a family member a lover in any in any form a fire sign a sagittarius a leo or an aries person be careful of conflict i feel like some of you are um are fighting for the same thing or there's like a lot of competition with a fire sign um you know fire is fire i mean virgo you guys are amazing but whoever this fire sign is they seem a bit unstable and they're very me 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 so um and i know that Sometimes, Virgo, you guys, you know, you guys like to be the best, and you are, and you know you are. You guys win. You win. <laughs> um, this one, you may want to just walk away. Just back away slowly from this fire sign because this person's unstable. They're not working with a full deck. Stay away from them. I'm a water sign, by the way. Yeah. You guys chew me up and spit me out. So I know never, ever mess with a Virgo. I know that. <laughs> All right, you guys, I love you guys. You guys are amazing. You're very goal-oriented. You guys always look good. You always smell good. You always got it together. You never find a Virgo that doesn't have it together. At least I've never seen one, never heard of one. Um, 
But yes, yeah, so some of you are moving and relocating. Some of you are even going overseas. Some of you are traveling for work. It, it looks good because both of these are positive cards. So if you guys do have to travel or move, these are going to be successful things. So you're going to be moving from one spot to something better. That's what both of these cards represent on the end. Moving from, I mean, you might already be in an awesome place, but guess what? You're moving to something better. And then with the temperance card, some of you are going to start going back to church, uh, working on your spirituality, starting to meditate, um, really getting in touch with your roots. I even see some of you doing those ancestry things um, just for the heck of it. Also, I see a lot of you um, that are getting past life readings, um, that are uh, just just really trying to figure some things out. Also, some of you, um, some of you may, <laughs> I know it sounds weird. Some of you may have to be getting DNA tests too. Either adult people getting DNA tests to find out who the parents are, or this is uh, adults that have to find out who the father of their or mother of the children are. It's just some weird, intricate stuff. There's some questions that are going to be had, whether this is in a custody situation, a legal situation. I think it's just protocol. Maybe some of you for child support, the child support office is just going to ask that you do DNA. It's no big deal. It's just something that may come up. Also, um, let me see anything else here. Yeah, so just just be careful of a fire sign. Um, a Sagittarius, an Aries, or a Leo. Because um, it looks like you guys are all fighting for the same thing. I'm picking up competition of some sort. So this could be in family. This could be at work. This could be in love. Also, if you are um, if you are with a fire sign and this fire sign is acting weird, I'm picking up more Sagittarius. But it could be a Leo or an Aries. Um, this person may be with somebody else. And that's what this conflict and fighting is. Watch what you're fighting for. Do you really want to fight for a man or a woman that's got five other people? I mean, is that really a prize to be won? I mean, it's your choice. If you want to fight for for this, for whoever this uh, this very popular individual is, go for it. But I don't think it's worth it. Yeah, I don't think I don't think that you're gonna want that prize. You're gonna have to bleach him or bleach her to clean him up. I don't know if you want all that. Um, be careful. And then with this, uh, with the temperance card here, well, how I was saying about the DNA and then all the conflict and fighting, um, I'm feeling like maybe a fire sign in the picture is uh, saying that they're not the father or that somebody else is not the father of their baby, that really it's this one. Be careful with that because this person may not honestly know. Or this person does know and they're trying to lie to somebody and say, oh, no, 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 she gets around or that ain't my kid. Just be mindful of that. There's some deception going on with the pregnancy and with some DNA. But with the rainbow here, it looks like the outcome is going to be great. So if you're watching this video and DNA is coming up and you're kind of on the hot seat, like uh, I was kind of having a good time back then, the rainbow card is here. So if, if the rainbow card would make you happy to know that it isn't your kid, then yes. If the rainbow card in this situation is you knowing exactly who the father is, then you got the rainbow. So you, things are good in that department. Everything's good. And with this water sign sitting right next to you, the temperance, I would say go water. It's probably water. All right, guys, I hope this was helpful. This was your mid-monthly. I am going to attempt so hard, my phone is so slow, to try to do weekly readings for you guys. All right, ta-ta for now.